chapter is of uh, linear equations and quadratic equations and decimal ratios these all chapter So hey guys welcome to the third video of the GRE preparation series and in this video we are going to talk about specifically the quant books which you need to uh, like read or practice to get a very good quant score. So I personally recommend this books and in the previous two parts if you haven't watched it I have put it in the, the, the link in the description below and in the first part I told you about the G, uh, GRE structure and in the second part I told you about all the resources of GRE preparation. In this video, we are going to specifically talk about the quant section. So let us get started. So the first book for the GRE uh, quant section is the NOVA's GRE guide and it is like the masterpiece of GRE quant section because it has around 23 chapters and uh, each chapter is uh, like corresponding to each and every uh, section. For example, first chapter is of uh, linear equations and quadratic equations and decimal ratios. These all chapters are combined and the, uh, this book teaches a lot of shortcuts as well as the difficulty level keeps on going. It does not like shoot up like uh, first you dealt with easy questions and difficult ones. So it is a much to do book for the quant section. The second book is the Kaplan GRE Maths workbook and it has around 600 questions and you also get 6 free practice tests along with it. So this book uh, mainly focuses on the practice, it does not teach you about the concept, you have to practice and practice about it. So it uh, like increases your practice acumen and if you want to do a lot of questions then this book is for you. The next book is a Prin uh, Princeton's review cracking the GRE uh, for the mathematics one and this book contains around 150 questions uh, you have to practice and it also has one practice test and uh, there is a separate section of 200 drill questions which you can do it on your own and there are separate explanations for it. So this book is for uh, each and every one of you so uh, this book emphasizes on the strategies as well as the concepts as well as you get a lot of practice and at the end, at the end you can do a free practice test with the book. The next book is uh, uh, McGraw-Hill's Conquering the New GRE Mathematics book and if you know anyone who is just starting for the GRE quant preparation then bo this book is for him or her and uh, this basically uh, like br brushes up your skills of the quant section and if you want to quickly brush up skills and practice a few questions then this book is for you and mind you this is one of the oldest publications of the McGraw-Hill series and uh, it focuses on uh, they basically tell you about the exam, st exam structure the strategies on how to like uh, like go towards the question how to approach the question and there are a lot of questions regarding the maths as well as the advanced maths question so uh, the level may not be the exact GRE level but you will get a good practice. The next book is the power score GRE quantitative book and this book is uh, like uh, like after many reviews I think this book is the best book for the GRE quant preparation according to a few people and uh, this book has around 350 questions and it is around I think 20 bucks. So these, uh, this book basically teaches you all the unconventional methods to solve the question. They do not give you like how to approach it. They ba basically tell you like how to approach it in a given time frame because you have a limited time frame, time frame in the GRE test and there are 350 questions in the book. So this is for anyone who wants to practice a lot of questions and uh, like learn unconventional ways to solve a problem in the GRE exam. So the last book in the coin section is, is the power bank of all the books which is the Manhattan 5LB book and this has a lot of uh, questions so if you have the time then only do this book because there are around 800 plus questions in each and every topic uh, total and this book also has a th uh, three practice tests which are medium to hard level. So the only con which I find in this book is people get confused in which topic to do and which topic not to do but if you have a lot of time and if you want to like uh, do a lot of questions because this is the question bank of the quant section and with 800 plus questions they will show uh, there is surely quality in the type of questions offered so if you have the time then do this book so this is it for the video guys and in this video we basically uh, learned how how to prepare for the quant section and which books are available for best preparation of the quant section and this was only the third part of the GRE preparation series and in the upcoming parts I will be talking to you about how to like master the GRE verbal section also the tips and tricks of the quant section and in the next video I will be talking to you about the best books for the GRE verbal section so there is a lot of content coming in so if you like the video do give it a like and subscribe the channel if you like the content and uh, this video is not enough, we'll next video. Mein.
my enemy You should've known I'd never kiss the rain Ice runs